Hello friends, welcome to a new geometry lesson. Today we are going to learn about quadrilaterals. Do you remember your previous lesson? Yes, we talked about polygons. Quadrilaterals are polygons as well. So let's go and learn about quadrilaterals. Quadrilaterals. Quad means four. Lateral means sides. What shape do I have on my rug? Yes, this is a square. It has one, two, three, four corners. That's why it is a polygon. Let's see how many sides does it have? One, two, three, four. So that way it is a quadrilateral. So a square is also a quadrilateral. What shape do I have now? Yes, this is a rectangle. It has one, two, three, four sides. So this is a rectangle. What shape do I have now on my rug? This is a trapezoid. It has one, two, three, four sides. A trapezoid. I have one more shape on my rug. Have you seen this one before? This is a trapezoid as well. One, two, three, four. But this shape is a right angled trapezoid. We will learn about right angles in our future lessons. I have one more shape on my rug that has one, two, three, four sides. This shape is a parallelogram. This shape is a specialized parallelogram. It has one, two, three, four sides and it is a rhombus. So this was our lesson on quadrilaterals. If you are my first year friends, I would like you to trace these sh shapes and write their names. If you are a second year friend, how about we trace these shapes, write their names and also mention how many sides do they have. And if you are a third year friend, how about we draw these shapes with a help of a ruler instead of tracing them and write the definition in our own words. Once you've presented the lesson of, on quadrilaterals, this is a perfect book for a follow up. It is If I Were a Quadrilateral. So it talks about the different shapes and how quadrilaterals have four straight sides and how we find them in our daily lives like a yoga mat, the checkerboard, the shape of a kite. So I hope you enjoyed this lesson and I shall see you soon with a new lesson. Thank you for watching friends. Bye.